All right, this is the uh, eighth grade TCAP practice test. This is question number 32. Now, there's a couple ways that you can go about doing this. The easiest way, by the way, is just to punch in the calculator, but whatever. Um, let's talk about the order of operations for like three seconds. When I'm working with exponents, whatever I do to the numbers, I have to do one less operation to the exponents. So when it says the 8.4 times 10 to the 36 divided by 3, point, 3 times 10 to the 9th, I'm dividing the two numbers. So I divide 8.4 by 3. And when I divide 8.4 by 3, I get 2.8. When I divide, the thing less than divide in the order of operations to subtract. So that's what I do to the, uh, the uh, exponents. I'm sorry. 36 is bigger than 9, so it's on top. So my 10 to the is going to stay on top. 36 minus 9 gives me 27, so I get 2.8 times 10 to the 27. Now this holds true as long as your original division has it in uh, correct scientific notation. It says 2.8. If it had been 28, I would have to move that over, which would increase that 27 to a 28. It doesn't do that here. So the answer to number 32 is just H. Or if you hate that method and you just want to type it in the calculator, you can put it in as a fraction. You can do a big uh, parentheses division if you would like to. So you just do parentheses 8.4 times 10 to the 36, close parentheses, divide, parentheses again, 3, point, uh, 3 times 10 to the 9th. So if you are going to do it that way, you need to make sure that you do the whole parentheses thing. Otherwise, you could get the wrong answer and really annoy yourself. So you have to put that this parentheses in, otherwise it'll just divide by 3 and then you'll get some weird answer. If you have a TI-84+, plus, if you'd like to do this as a fraction for some reason, or, you know, it's probably the easiest way to do it, you hit the alpha button, which is the green button, and you hit the Y equals and your fraction menu pops up. Pick number 1, and then you can type in 8.4 times 10 to the 36, and then click down to go to the bottom of the fraction. 3 times 10 to the 9th and hit enter and it should give you something that looks like 2.8 e to the 27th and that means times 10 to the 27th right there so it's h either way whatever you want to do if you have a different calculator there's probably a different method